This video will walk you through how to use the APA style document template in Microsoft Word 2016. Open up Microsoft Word, select new document, and then you'll see this option of template. Usually when you're creating a document from scratch, you use the blank document, but you'll see they also give you some template options here. One of the options will be APA style report. If this doesn't show up, in your options on your home screen, you can type it into the search box. When you find it, click on it and click create. I delete this top bar and you can work right in the document itself. You're going to want to double click on the running head. It's going to give you the option to put in your shortened title in all caps. It's going to automatically be in all caps for you. And then you'll need to double click on the title page information. It'll tell you exactly what to put where. You put the title here. You'll put your name here. And then your institutional affiliation will be Herzing University. The APA template has a lot of information you probably won't need. For most of your classes, you won't be required to use an author's note, so you can highlight it and delete it. You'll see that the title carries on to the second page in all caps with the page numbers. In some classes, you'll have to do an abstract, but most of the time you won't for your essays, so you can highlight it and delete it if you don't need it. Then you'll see that the rest of the document has jumped up to the top of page two and your title will automatically be repeated again. This is where you can start typing your paper now. The heading guidelines are provided. If you want to put a heading here, you can put your first heading and then fill in your information. If you need any subsequent headings, there are guidelines here on how to format those. If you don't need any additional headings, you can delete all of this extra information. If you scroll down to the next page, you'll see that the reference page is started for you. The reference page will always be at the top of a clean page. Keep scrolling down and you'll notice that there will also be some additional information at the bottom of the APA template. You rarely will need footnotes, so unless you're writing a paper that requires footnotes, you can delete those. There are some guidelines on how to use tables, and if you need tables for your paper, please read through that. If you don't need these tables, make sure you delete them. And same with figures. If there are figures in your paper, read through how to include figures. If you don't have figures, just go ahead and delete that. So here's what this will look like all together from the top. You'll see your title page with your running head, title in all caps, page number. You'll have your title repeated in the middle of your title page your name, your university. Scroll on to page two. You'll see your title at the top, all caps, with the page number, your title repeated. You'll start writing your text of your essay here. If you're using headings, your heading will go right under that paragraph, and then you can start the next paragraph. If you need other headings, you follow this formatting where it's bold and centered for your first level heading. And then you have your reference page at the end on a clean page.